fam. Today we're doing the Maligma Balls paint sprayer. It's a cordless paint sprayer. It's a HVLPP sprayer. Uh, you know, that stands for IVLPP. Runs off your DeWalt batteries, or I know they also make a Milwaukee and a Makita version. Comes with four different nozzle diameters. It holds up to 1200 milliliters of paint, which honestly is not that much. Viscosity, 30 to 50 dinners. I honestly, I don't know what that is. I know this is made for thinner stuff like uh, stains and whatnot, but you know what? I don't do staining. I use uh, latex paint, yeah. Please don't fill it with gasoline and then set it on fire or you'll have to contact uh, Yuan Li at uh, 49111111, whatever that is. Originally it came out of the box like this in two separate parts without a nice shiny flex bolt battery and uh, these little accessories here, these are your tips. It did come with the white tip, but it looks a little small, so I went and swapped it for the black tip. This is your air generator. All you have to do is depress this and it makes some air. Genius, I know. You place this, line it up with the notches there, and insert. You should hear a click when done. There we go. A couple of different things to note. This controls whether you're doing an upside down oval or a sideways oval. Did I say that right? Whatever, I'm not editing it. This controls the width of your egg. You know, big egg, little egg. And this little nozzle right here, which is basically just a plastic cap on a spring, controls your flow. Taking a peek inside, it suctions the paint with a straw. Yeah, a straw. So make sure to pre-filter your paint before putting it in there. I've got this bad boy loaded up with some water, so let's shoot a little bit of water and see how it does. If it does well, I'll fill it with paint. Oh, I saw that. So the black tip is pretty thick and uh, there's a bit of drippage. Doesn't matter though, because I have a whole ass house to paint, so let's get this bad boy going. All right, I got this exterior grade a uh, super old, you guys can see, really old latex paint here. And we're just gonna thin it out with a little bit of water and see how it goes. Man, this is thick. It's literally pushing the stick out of the paint. I'm not pulling that up, by the way. <laughs> All right, I've got it mixed with some water. It's uh, not as viscous. Using a ratio of uh, yoo instead of chocolate milk. Full disclosure, I am not a painter. I'm just some guy that does stuff. That's not bad. Pretty good coverage, considering this is less chocolate milk and more uh, yoo -hoo. But not bad. Let me go ahead and take care of the whole house here. And it will run on you if you let it sit too long. So don't do that. That's what she looks like after two passes and all the paint is gone. However, pros, no clogged tip. Cons, she does ejaculate prematurely. Is this a must buy? No. Is it awesome? I'd say so, it's pretty good. It's gonna take about two or three coats to paint the entire house, but I'm gonna be done in a couple hours by myself. That's not bad. Just to compare a bit, this is the paint I've shot with a Graco X5, I think it was, before it clogged. And uh, this is the Maligma Balls. Not bad. Link will be in the description or in my profile. Have at it. Good luck.